Yo, 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 what's the deal? What's the deal? It's your boy, who is Hendo, and we back talking sports. So, shout out my boy, Buki Allen, bro. You feel me? Shout out my boy, because he actually uh, gave me some of these. You feel me? So, this is the shot chart for um, <clears throat> Golden State. And the Warriors, right? I mean, Golden State and the Warriors. Golden State and the Lakers, right? I've been hearing on all these uh, basketball groups and everything like that that the the Warriors are not getting calls because all they do is really shoot threes. Well, I'm looking at this chart, and it looked pretty even to me. You feel me? It looks pretty even to me, bro. Like, y'all can't see the whole thing, but it was 21 files to 22 files, right? So, then you got, you know what I'm saying? Sorry about that. Then you got the free throw disparity, right? But we turned the ball over too much. 19 turnovers. I'm going to tell you why we lost. Nine, listen, free throws, come on, bro. They cannot beat us if they don't like if they don't shoot at least more than 20 free throws. And the three-pointer, they shot 48% from the three, right? We shot 29%. Not hitting shots. Turning the ball over a little too much. That's why we really lost, bro. You know what I'm saying? But my thing is this, though. This is my thing, though. The Warriors, right? They got, uh, I believe they have 40, 44 points in the paint. Right? No, 34 points in the paint. The Lakers have 32. Free throws attempted. Man, listen, bro. Let me tell y'all something, God. The refs is not why we lost. I'm a Warriors fan, and I'm low-key not one of them guys that's going to be up here talking about, oh, yeah, the uh, the lake, the refs this and the refs that. No, 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 no. The refs is not the sole reason why we lost, bro. Not the sole reason why we lost, bro. The sole reason why we lost is, I just told you, we didn't hit shots. We did not hit shots. They got to the free throw line. The refs was caught, was giving them the calls. But we didn't help ourselves either. Clay Thompson with six turnovers. You know what I'm saying? I don't know what's going on with Steph at the free throw line. Jordan Poole is fucking atrocious, and I wish they stopped playing him and give his minutes to Jonathan Kaminga. Give all his minutes to Jonathan Kaminga or Moses Moody, bro. Moses Moody can shoot better than Jordan Poole. He's playing better than Jordan Poole. Give Moses Moody Jordan Poole's minutes right now, bro. Kavon Looney, I love Loon. He is not the offensive big man. He cannot hang with AD. He can't, bro. AD is a, is dominant on the defensive end and the offensive end, bro. Looney is a phenomenal rebounder and a good defender. But, bro, I've been saying this for the last eight to nine years, bro, even when we was winning. At some point in time, we're going to have to get a big man, bro, an offensive big man that can, can put the ball in the hoop. Not even 30, 40. I'm talking about like maybe 15, 20 points, bro. That is offensively skilled. We're going to have to get some type of big man that can do something offensively. You feel me? And rim protect. And we had, we, we still have not did that, bro. Even though we didn't won four championships, even though they didn't won four championships, Golden State and everything, we still have not done that, though. And I really hope, regardless of what happened this year, whether we lose this series to the Lakers, which I'm still not believing we're going to do that. I believe we're still going to win this series. 
I'm a, I'm confident. Until I see them walk off the court, then I'll be like, okay. But until then, I don't lose faith in my boys. <clears throat> I don't care if it's LeBron. It could be whoever on the other side. But it's just we haven't found a big man, and it hasn't hurt us as bad. But now it's tearing us up. You feel me? I said this. I said we should have went out and got Miles Turner. I said we should have traded for uh, yeah, Miles Turner. I said a couple of years ago, I said it was a crazy thought, but I said when the rumors about Giannis was about, I was like, man, sure, we could find some way to get him. We should. I said we just need some type of offensive big man. You feel me? We haven't had that since Andrew Bogut, bro. But I hear all these Laker fans, all these LeBron fans, Y'all do this every game, bro. Say the series over or see, see, see this. And I tell y'all, I said, y'all going to win the game. If y'all got the free throw advantage, you feel me? And when y'all have the free throw advantage, it's not a regular free throw advantage. Y'all have the free throw advantage by at least 15, 20. When they give me y'all calls, they give me y'all calls. I mean, you could touch Dennis Schroeder, foul line. You could nigga, you could touch uh, Austin Reeves, foul but I didn't. But Curry can go to the lay and get bumped off his get bumped and he fall and no call. So that's why I say Golden State they really didn't play well, bro. I'm watching it. We up forty to twenty nine. They start turning the damn ball over. They start turning the ball over, which leads to take fouls, which leads to free throws for them, which leads for them getting all the way back into the game. They shot like six free throws in a row. You feel me? Turnovers and just motherfucking crazy ass flagrant foul. That Moses Moody, that was not a flagrant foul, bro. This is this league is pussy, bro. For real. You feel what I'm saying? So my thing with Golden State is you know you up against it. You saw what I put up there. Golden State versus the refs and Lakers. And I'm not saying that the refs is the reason they lost, but I'm saying that Golden State has to be mindful. And know that y'all up against it, bro. Y'all don't have the benefits of the ref, of the whistle. You're not getting that, bro. You should know that through. You should know that after the first game, bro. You feel me? Throughout this series, you're not going to get the benefit of the whistle, bro. The Lakers and the Warriors attacked the paint at the same amount of time. I think 35% of the time. They attack in the paint the same amount of time as the same amount. But guess who get more free throws? You feel what I'm saying? The Warriors, the Warriors probably in the shot, what? They had nine in the first game, 17 in the second game. They shot, what, 34 free throws. The Lakers have shot over 90 free throws, bro. Come on, bro. But Golden State has to play better. They have to play better. Stop turn. The only way they can beat us is when we turn the ball over, give them possessions, and start sending them to the free throw line and then doing, you know what I'm saying, doing dumb junk, bro. Jordan Poole, bro, he got to get on the bench, bro. You got to treat, he got to go to the bench, bro. You cannot keep playing him. He is hurting us. Five points in 22 minutes, that, bro, he's not doing nothing for us, bro. It's time to get rid of this cat, bro. Like, you know I'm saying it's time to sit him down, bro. Give Moses Moody the minutes that you need that you're trying to give him. Now, I want to show y'all something else before I end this video. Points in the paint Warriors 34, Lakers 32, free throws attempted. Warriors 15, Lakers 37. And shout out to Two Raw because I didn't notice. I fell asleep on like the last part of the game. The war, the Lakers had, uh, they was up to like thirty-seven attempts, and the Warriors had eight. And then the fourth quarter came along, and then they started giving them more calls. I mean, more, uh, more free throws when the game was already over. But you can see right here, free throws attempted, Warriors fifteen, Lakers thirty-seven. Points in the paint, Warriors thirty-four, Lakers thirty-two. And then another thing. Like I said, they both attacked the paint at a 35% clip. Shout out to my boy Buki Allen for the uh for the graphic. And it's 
it's laughable, bro. And the, like I said, the Warriors are not helping themselves. You feel me? By you know what I'm saying, turning the ball over and you know what I'm saying, <clears throat> Jordan Poole over dribbling, doing dumb junk. You know what I'm saying? Clay having six goddamn turnovers. You know what I'm saying? That's not you're not helping yourself. You know what I mean? You know what's against you. So you gotta be we got no margin for error, bro. You know what I'm saying? Game four is a must win, bro. We must win game four. We must win. We win game four. We go back home. You feel me? And try to take it lead. You feel me? Try to go up three two. You know what I'm saying? But we must win game four. We have to come out with better energy, less turnovers. You feel me? Defending without fouling is our biggest problem, bro. When we defend without fouling, game two happens. When we defend and we send them to the line 37 times, game, this game happened. And the real reason it was a blowout was because we shot poorly from the three. If we shot, if we could have got our shots to fall, it wouldn't have been. But that Couple with them sh shooting 20 more free throws than us. Come on, bro. And then the bench was not good, bro. Bench was not good, bro. We need more production from that bench, bro. Clay got to have a better game. You feel me? Steph was okay, but you know what I'm saying? He going to turn it up. It's just they, they bro, they got to play better, bro. You know what I'm saying? They got stuff stacked against them, but it don't matter shit and if they don't play better, bro. So... You know what I'm saying? As as like I'm a Warrior fan. As much as I know y'all us I know y'all war, us Warriors fans and everything, Dub Nation, and everything, want to blame the refs. We gotta look at our own squad too, bro. Because they was not good, bro. You know what I'm saying? They didn't shoot well. We shot 29% from the three. The Lakers shot 48%. You're not gonna win that game, bro. Plus, they giving them all the calls. And y'all, y'all uh attacking the paint at the same percentage. Come on, bro. The Warriors got to be perfect. I'm already expecting the Lakers to win the championship this year. They're going to do it for Brian. They're going to do it for them because they love the Lakers. You feel me? Hey, y'all can say what y'all want to say in the comments. Oh, you you just hating. You just this and that. It's facts, bro. I'm a Kobe Bryant fan. I didn't see them cheat for them, bro. I'm a Kobe Bryant fan, so I know. 2002, the Kings was actually supposed to be in the finals. Listen, I know it's always been a Laker bias. Always. The Warriors have always got the short end of the stick. Even winning championships, always got the short end of the stick, bro. So, yeah, game four, they just got to play better. And they got to stop, stop, just defend without filing, bro. Defend without filing because you know you start filing, they might call it a flagrant, you know, two this and two that. They they not fucking with the Warriors. They not that they're not getting no benefit of the doubt, bro, with the whistle. So they have to play better. As long as we hit shots and do not turn the ball over, we good, bro. This being who is in though. I'm out.